All right, so it's kind of funny that all the animals are gathered around to eat all of the bigs. And these two horses have put their ears back and they're running all of the other animals away. So what's weird about that, look at this. <laughs> this is the crazy thing. This is crazy. So Bucky's would have never, ever, ever done that until we got voodoo. And all of a sudden, since voodoo has shown up, Bucky's has gained all of this confidence in himself and all this courage. And now he like totally wants everyone to know that he's in charge, except for voodoo. These guys get along great, but they have seemed, because we also know that voodoo suffer from confidence and you know self-esteem issues. And now that they've kind of found each other, they have totally run this show. So, I mean, if, the, if that is not the definition of a companion animal and what it requires, you know, what <laughs> I'm watching the pigs play. I'm sorry, I'm watching the pigs play. I, I'm on, so it's like I have ADHD or something. I'm just like jumping all around. It was cute the way Oli was running, dancing. They get so excited for feed time. Wait. Did he just lay? Did he just lay? Oh, he's scratching his butt. Oh my goodness. Okay, it's time to feed the bigs. And it can be a circus. Hey. What's hard about this? Hey. I'm the bucket over. I know. Back up, dude. No, get out of there. You're making me mess up this video. I'm trying to make a video and dad's gonna be mad. No, no. Okay. Okay. Oh my God. No. Back it up. <laughs> this video is all about CJ. And Moo. I give up. This is a fail. Hey. Get out of there. No. No. Well, if nothing else. Folks, can you get an idea of the chaos that is every afternoon at five o'clock? So, back up. We have all kinds of different things we have to feed the animals. So the horses have to have this alfalfa. No. Hey, Bucky. Here. So Bucky's and Ivy. Decided here which trough the horse will eat out of. Yes. Because they all. <laughs> okay. This is this is really hard. Baby, you gotta help me. Look what they're doing. Move. 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 Baby, I need I can't move. Get back. Oh Lord. <laughs> Who needs a feed trough? I'm mad now, so you really can't video this. How am I gonna make a video out of that nonsense? People are gonna think we run some kind of a ragtag operation. We do. Well, no one has to know it. They already know it. Right, y'all? My bucket didn't even have a handle. Well. How ragtag is this? Back up, back up. Y'all, nothing goes as planned, ever. I just hope folks don't judge. So, so let's talk about what went wrong there. Okay. What went wrong is the same thing that always goes wrong. There's no organization to how we do this because there's no way to organize it. There's so many different kinds of feeds that different animals need in their diet. So I can't just bring out a big bucket of the same thing. I have to bring out individual buckets of different things and divide them all up according to where they're eating at. Horses need alfalfa. The cows don't. So I have to kind of allow them to decide where they're gonna eat at 
And that's why I decide what to feed who. The cows need their grains. Oh, they're getting their grains all they right. They all get their food. Oh. So that's what makes it so hard is knowing who's who and what's where. Y'all? And then I can't be over here and over there at the same time. If anybody knows another system, a better system, but it has to be a feasible system. Don't say they should all have their own stalls, their own stables, because guys, it has to be feasible. We don't have stables and stalls for all these animals. Maybe at some point, but that will be well into the future. But for now, we kind of feed them in a circle so they can kind of move around at will. But uh, like I say, I cannot guard all of the other buckets at the same time that I'm feeding. Yeah, they're definitely on to your antics because a week ago, they didn't do that. Okay. Lester's done. So this is rare. Besides Ringo, this is like a group photo. If I could take a screenshot of this, well, everybody's in this picture except for Ringo. All of the donkeys, the horses, all the cows, all baby goats. Ringo is the only one who's been separated right now because he's been so mean to Ernie. And Ernie's still new around here. I'm trying to get a group photo, guys. I'm trying to get a group photo. I don't want just you three. I need a, I need a group photo. <laughs> I am Betty, baby girl. I do love you, Betty. I do, Betty. You're a good girl. But I need a group photo. So you realize what's going on here, right? This is like a group photo. It's like a group photo. Oh, yeah. The only animal not here in this picture would be the dogs and Ringo. Ringo's in solitary <laughs> confinement for a while. <laughs> That's well, well said. Solitary confinement. Ringo has been naughty. Well, and Petunia. Well, Petunia, Petunia's not like in trouble though. That's what she prefers. Yeah, Petunia likes her solitude. 